Hey you all, happy festivities and welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video we are making some yellow pilau, holiday special. Let's get to the video. I'm going to start by boiling my meat. I'm going to use 500 grams of beef steak. I'm going to pre-wash it and chop it. I'll then add it to a pot. I'm then going to add salt to taste and black pepper to taste. I'm then going to fire up my stove. And then I'll cover my pot and cook my meat until it's soft as shown in the video. After our meat is ready, I'm going to set it aside. I'm then going to add 2 tablespoons pilau masala to a preheated pan and 1 tablespoon ground turmeric powder. I'm then going to burn it for a while as shown in the video. I know you're wondering why I'm burning my pilau masala. I'm doing it so as to wake up all the spices, spices I mean in the pilau masala. On the same pot that we used to boil our meat, I'm going to add half a cup cooking oil, regular cooking oil, one medium sized chopped white onion, half a medium sized chopped red onion, and then I'm going to fry the onions until they are translucent as shown in the video. If you don't have white onion, you can just use two medium sized red onions. I'm now going to add 2 tablespoons ginger and garlic paste and then I'll also fry them with the onion mixture for a while as shown in the video. I'm now going to add two medium sized potatoes, Irish potatoes, that I already peeled and washed and chopped. I'll also fry them for a while as shown in the video. I'm now going to add our warm, our warm pilau masala that we had already burned in the beginning of the video. I'm then going to mix everything well so that the meat and the vegetables absorb the pilau masala really, really well as shown in the video. I'm now going to cover my pot for a few minutes. I'm now going to add my two cups of white rice that I already washed. I already prepared and washed and, and drained. And then I'm going to mix everything well together 
as shown in the video. Making sure that the rice absorbs the flour masala mixture. I'm now going to add four and a half cups of hot water. I mean, you can also set one cup of hot water aside to balance your pilau. You have to use hot water on this, you guys. You can't use cold water. And then I'm going to mix it well together, as shown in the video. And then I'm going to add some salt to taste, as shown in the video. I'll also taste to make sure that I, I, to know if I need to adjust any salt, I'm sorry. And then I'm going to add one medium sized chopped tomato. And then I'll cover my pot and cook my pilau until all the water is drained. I need to adjust your water if the pilau is not fully cooked. I mean if the rice is raw. Our pilau is now ready you guys and look at it. It looks really really delicious. You can just eat your pilau just the way it is. But with me I'm going to set it aside and then I'll make a side dish. I'm going to be making some minced meat stew for my toddler. To another pot, I'm going to add some oil and then I'm going to preheat my oil as shown in the video. I'll then add half a kilogram of minced meat. I'll then fry it for a while as shown in the video. I'm now going to add some chopped green onions, spring onions. I'll also fry them together as soon as they need them. After a while, I'm going to add two medium sized chopped tomatoes and some chopped coriander. I'll also add some salt to taste and then I'm going to fry the mixture for a few minutes as shown in the video. I'm now going to add my favorite seasoning. I'm going to add two Royco cubes. And then I'm going to mix it very well as shown in the video. And then I'll cover my pot so the tomatoes soften as shown in the video. I'm 
I'm now going to add one cup of fresh milk and then I'll mix my minced meat well as shown in the video and then I'll cover it and cook it for a while until it's fully cooked. Smith stew is now ready you guys it looks really really good I'm then going to set it aside Moving on to another step, I'm now going to fry some cabbage. I'm going to add some oil to a pot and then I'm going to preheat it. I'll then add one medium sized chopped shredding now. And then I'm going to add some green pepper. I'll then fry them for a while as soon as the video. I'm now going to add my chopped cabbage. I'll also fry it for a while as shown in the video. I'm now going to cover my cabbage and steam it for a few minutes. Our cabbage is now ready in this. Our pilau our, and our side dish is now ready in this. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. And thanks for watching. See you in my next video. And make sure you subscribe to my channel for more videos. And thanks for watching. Bye.